What's going on all my Uchiyas and Uchikas and welcome back today guys it is Wednesday so let's talk more to episode 14 man what what a crazy episode like it's Boruto is like really getting better and better like i swear like <laughs> for the longest this show has dragged on but it's really picking up so let's start with episode 14 so it starts out with uh with uh naruto and uh, kakashi like they're trying to figure out you know what's going on you know with the uh with the whole uh that uh, i i think i keep saying new i, I think it's pronounced something else but uh n-u-e new new e no, something like that they're trying to figure out you know what happened uh you know where this monster teleport to and they came to the conclusion that um that whoever did this whoever casted jutsu maybe they transferred along with the monster because they were looking for traces and naruto you know he was using the sage mode and he couldn't find anything so you know yeah kakashi brought it up that you know maybe whoever did this is gone with the monster so it kind of switched over to Bartu after that um like he was uh teleported to like uh this this is kind of like a almost like um weird like tree cave i can't really explain it but um it's like a weird tree cave and uh so you know he's looking for the class rep and whatnot and he actually ran into the monster and um and you know so they kind of duped it out for for a good bit um Boruto in this one like he really he really like knows how to utilize his shadow clones like pretty well i'm i was kind of impressed like he was really kind of holding his own with the uh, uh with new and whatnot but um a weird thing too about his eye uh like when he looked at the monster like it, it like it did like the same shit as the Byakugan like it saw all the chakra flow and it saw like all the the chakra points I think that's what it's called like, yeah like the actual points in their bodies and whatnot so I don't know what this eye is I don't know if this is an eye that has all characteristics like it has all like um like I don't know if it's you know the Byakugan mixed in with you know other shit Sharingan I, I don't know I doubt I mean I don't really mean you know Sharingan because you know he's not Uchiha but still like this this eye is freaking like this I, I, I'm starting to think this eye is OP to the max like strictly to the max but um so you know uh, after uh, you know Barto was handling his own um with the monster and whatnot and you know he noticed the actual shocker points and noticed like this spot in his tail uh, Minsky kind of saved them because uh, you know he was kind of zoning out, you know, focusing, on, focusing in on all that, and uh, you know, um, you know, so Minsky and Barto, you know, they, they kind of teamed up, and um, and this is another part where he also utilizes his, his shadow clones too, because like he used them to plant like these paper bombs, he used paper bombs to trap the monster, and um, and so uh, damn, what was I about to say? He actually used paper bombs to trap uh new and use Minsky as like a, almost like as this diversion I mean which is really clever because most we've seen from Borto I mean it's been kind of like uh you know kind of kind of like uh this bullshitter not really know not really know what not really knowing what to do and whatnot and like just kind of going with the flow but he actually like used some real tactic in this uh episode which I'm really surprised about I mean granted he is you Naruto's kid but um yeah like he really came through in this one so after uh after uh, you know Minsky, he was about to close in for the kill after they trapped uh, New. You know that's when um the class rep, you know, she showed up, and um and, and <laughs> this where it got really good because her and Minsky like they duped it out, they duped it out again and it was man it was so beautiful man like I was because <laughs> I mean like just like just like her just like uh, the class rep skill like it, it like is is so it's, it was just so amazing because you wouldn't think you know she would be capable of uh. You know of such great uh hand-to-hand -hand combat you know and that we also kind of saw that in episode 13 with against her and minsky but this was part two which i was ready for this shit like I, i'm like oh shit this is round two like here we go like barto stay out of this shit you know so after they uh duped it out for a second of course barto intervened like he like he normally would and uh he actually took a, a kunai to the uh to the arm and whatnot and um you know he was uh you know you know telling them to stop and whatnot and uh you know minsky's like you know how can you know how can uh 
you know she you know she caused so much trouble and whatnot like she attacked the village and and shit like <laughs> like she fucked shit up for a lot of people and you know he's like you know he's not gonna leave someone you know he cares about behind he's not gonna leave his classmate behind which really you know surprised minsky because you know minsky's kind of like a kind of like um almost like this robot kind of guy you know either you know it's it's kind of like a how can i say it? either like you kind of live or die like he doesn't really see a like an in-between there um but Bartol, you know he finds like new ways of actually doing things which really surprised minsky in this one so yeah um so after uh you know they kind of you know calm down a bit um um new like actually came back and um you know class rep told her um new to you know take all his uh take all her um blah, take all of her uh chakra and um you know like you know just explode you know which is kind of crazy because you know that's some kamikaze shit i'm like oh shit like this bitch is like insane like she's about to take all of y'all with her <laughs> but um but you know uh new like you know he, you know, he started kind of like rubbing up against her, like almost like this, like a uh, dog. And Bartol, like you know, he probably sees you as, as a parent and whatnot. And you know, he probably you know, even though you, uh, you know, you raise him, you know, he doesn't, he doesn't want you know anything bad to happen to you, because you know, he, he actually cares for you and whatnot. And uh, we also see saw some stuff with um, with class rep and her uh, her past, and Bartol kind of um compared that to what um was going on going on with her now being that uh, her dad raised her to be a weapon and now you know she was kind of using new as a weapon and you know Bert was like do you really want to you know want him to turn out you know as just a weapon do you want to just use him for that you know and stuff like that so and he was a kind of a cool comparison so uh Bartow, like his eye activated again and uh he saw like um like the chakra flow like actually dissipate from around her and you know she could have she could have you know started to you know see clearly or whatnot and and uh, that little um, symbol on her back, like you know, actually like um, exploded and whatnot. So I guess you know she was free from that actual. Uh, I, I wouldn't say curse mark, but um, I forget what it was called in the show. But um, that little like seal on her back, like you know, in that contract with New. So um, you know, you know, so you know, I guess uh, you know, she was feeling kind of sorry for herself and ashamed of what she's done. So you know, after the uh, that curse exploded, you know, the like the. Uh, that whole dimension started to go haywire because you know all the chakra like it was going crazy because you know it was so much you know compact in one area so um you know Barto, you know told class rep you know let's not you know let's get out of here and uh you know she's kind of sitting there you know I, i'm shamed i guess you know she was you know really ready to die for you know what she's done because you know after what she did to the village and everyone you know there was really no going back for her but you know Barto was like you know like nah, fuck that. You know, you're my classmate. You know, I'm not gonna give up on you. And, um, you know, they actually, actually kind of left with uh, with new, and you know, Minsky. Uh, <laughs> for a second, I thought like Minsky was gone because um, it was just uh, her and class rep. I mean, uh, Bartu and class rep. And I was like, yo, where's Minsky? But um, you know, he he got out there too. And uh, you know, everything was uh, it was copacetic. Everything was cool. But um, new for some reason he stayed behind. I don't know if uh, I don't know why he stayed behind. But um, he was dead. I don't know. If I don't know if uh, if if he was like required to stay there or what, but um, he just didn't went back with the rest of the with uh, everyone else. So you know they uh, transferred back to the uh, to the village, you know, uh, and Denki uh, and uh, Denki Shigadai, and I think uh, Inojin was there too, if I if I'm uh, correct. Um, so they're looking for them, you know, and uh, and Barto, uh, Minsky, and Class you know, they fell from the sky and. Uh, you know, they're trying to Denki in the gang is trying to figure out what's going on with Barto in the gang. You know, Barto's like kind of like ducking the questions or whatnot. Like he's not really telling them. Like it was, like it was really cool because I had a feeling like like no, like they're they're not really gonna tell anybody about what's going on. And uh, the other ninjas from the village they came uh, along with Sai. And uh, you know, so class rep told um, Barto that you know she's gonna talk to Sai and whatnot because you know I mean because uh, you know Sai again he really wanted to help uh, whoever was going through this um like get out like the way he got out and um like kind of waiting you know naruto saved sai you know sai wanted to you know return uh not really return the favor but also show that kind of compassion for someone who was kind of stuck in the foundation like he was so it was really cool to um kind of see that you know kind of see class rep almost like kind of get redeemed well not really redeemed but got out of uh you know that whole vengeful um vengeful scenario that whole you know um attacking the village and whatnot um it was you know it was good for her to 
you know, really change her mind because uh, I mean, I, 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 even, even though it's like I don't think she's a main character, like she's still you know, you know, like you know, like a fun kid, you know, and it's, it's good to see her. So I mean, I, I'm glad you know she made it. I'm glad you know, you know, she didn't uh, really die in that uh, in that like tree cave, that other dimension, and whatnot. So I mean, it's cool. We're gonna see what, uh, what's gonna happen next week. Um, I mean, considering next week, I from the pre pre yeah, from the previews, I don't think they're gonna tell anybody about this i don't know if they're gonna even i mean of course they have to tell naruto but um <laughs> but um i don't as far as uh the class i don't know if uh if they're gonna inform them maybe Boruto's gonna tell them later i don't know but um yeah guys that's been pretty much episode 14 in a nutshell like it, it's been like it was really good like i did with the hand-to-hand -hand combat the uh ninjutsu like the redemption like it, it it was a pretty solid episode 13 and 14 like it really shined so I mean, again, I'm I'm ready for Naruto next week, man. Like I can't believe I'm saying this. I can't believe I'm saying this. Naruto. I mean, um, did I say Naruto? God damn it, Boruto. I keep thinking, <laughs> I keep thinking it's I'm fucking believable. But um, yeah, I'm ready for uh Boruto next week. You know, I can't believe I'm um, I can't believe I'm saying this. But uh, <sighs> man, I can't believe it, man. I mean, Boruto's still a bitch, but you know, I'm ready for episode uh 15 next week. But uh, yeah, guys, that's pretty much been uh, everything in a nutshell. Um, if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a like, uh, comment, and share it with all your friends. This has been your boy, The Apex Uchiha, and I'll see you guys in the next one. But until then, it is time for me to scatter. See you later.